Well, it's Sunday and most people know that at the church on Sunday means it's time for some soul food. Well, I have some soul food today that's going to benefit you. This is part one of three. The daunt that accompanies the frustration of the enemy that just won't stop. We've all had those moments. Snake after snake after snake after snake after snake. This can be natural, like it was for me, or a spiritual occurrence. Frustrations accompanied with more frustrating situations can make one weary quite fast. And it kind of comes with a bit of fear. He's not going to stop until he gets me. Your back is to the wall, and it can make you want to give up the fight and accept the defeat that seems destined. Hear me when I say, don't give up. God is still there. He will never leave you nor forsake you, no matter the situation. 2 Timothy 1 7, King James Version reads For God hath not given us the spirit of fear, but of power, and of love, and of a sound mind. Galatians 6 9, King James Version reads and let us not be weary in well-doing, for in due season we shall reap if we faint not. In the midst of it all, your mindset is important because you can miss the fact that God has protected you when faced with snake after snake after snake after snake. Frustration after frustration after frustration that could lead to life-altering outcomes. Luke 10, 19, King James Version reads, Behold, I give unto you power to tread on serpents and scorpions, and over all the power of the enemy, and nothing shall by any means hurt you. John 16, 33, King James Version reads, These things I have spoken unto you, that in me ye might have peace. In the world ye shall have tribulation, but be of good cheer, I have overcome the world. Joshua 1, 9, King James Version reads, Have not I commanded thee, be strong and of good courage, be not afraid, neither be thou dismayed, for the Lord thy God is with thee, whithersoever thou goest. Deuteronomy 31, 6, King James Version reads, Be strong and of good courage. Fear not, nor be afraid of them. For the Lord thy God, he it is that do go with thee. He will not fail thee, nor forsake thee. Tune in next week for the continuation of this word, part two.